Yo, what's up team? Your boy J3 is back in the building. You guys know what time it is. It is time to react. I'll say it and I'll say it again. Netflix is on fire. They got a brand new movie starring three iconic actors. Mob actors, bro. Robert De Niro, Joe Pesci, Al Pacino, and a new, brand new, Martin Scorsese film called The Irishman. Let's take a look at this official teaser trailer. Looks good already. Hello? Hi, my friend. I got that kid I was talking to you about here. They're I'm all put him on the phone and let you talk to him, okay? Hello? Is that Frank? Yes. Hi, Frank. This is Jimmy Hoffa. Glad to meet you. Glad to meet you, too, even if it's over the phone. Our friend speaks very highly of you. Thank you. Only three people in the world have one of these. And only one of them is Irish. I heard you paint houses. Hold on, please. Hold on, please. Yes, I do, sir. Where are you going? Going to work. Well, you know, there's a situation going on now, Frank. Big business and the government, they're trying to pull us down. You might be demonstrating the failure to show appreciation. Wow. I know things they don't know I know. You can't miss the big picture. Sooner or later. Get the gun out of his hand! Everybody put here as a date when he's gonna go. Do you want to be a part of this fight? Would you like to be a part of this history? Yes, I would. Whatever you need me to do, I'm available. Uh-huh. He likes to talk, don't he? Oh my gosh, this is gonna be epic. This is gonna be freaking epic, yo. A Martin Scorsese film. It's been a while, y'all. We ain't had a good mob movie in a while, yo. Some gangster shit. Old school gangster movies, baby. I love those type of films. I love those action scenes because they're just so raw. Click, 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 get them. All that shit, bro. Just straight deaths. Real life shit. Like, ain't no over exaggerating niggas doing backflips and shit. Yeah, shit just gets real. Oh man, uh, first impression. I ain't gonna lie. I might be a little biased on this one because I'm a big fan of, of Joe Pesci, Al Pacino, Robert De Niro, and Martin Scorsese as a director. I, I love his work, right? I grew up watching this type of stuff with my pops. So, you know, you between westerns and mob films and stuff like that, that's just what we did in my house. You know, we watched our adventures, Indiana Jones and stuff, but you know, you get my gist, right? So it's it's funny. And weird at the same time seeing these actors because they're older now and I remember when they were young yo and I was a little baby you know what I mean I'm a kid I'm what well, you know I'm I'm young like you know what I'm saying like I used to look my dad showed me a lot of stuff as a kid man and and I, I thank him for that I got a chance to really experience some stuff man and, and 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 I got a chance to watch it with my pops you know what I'm saying it wasn't by myself so he was able to guide me in certain areas like you know this is bad this is this but these are films so I got a chance to appreciate true films back then. But regardless of that, just seeing them older and then, you know, remember them when they were younger. You know what I mean? Like Robert De Niro's still doing things. Al Pacino's still doing things. But you really see, you rarely see Joe Pesci. And it's, it's a breath of fresh air seeing them come back. You know what I mean? I, I can imagine that phone call with Martin Scorsese like, yo, I got a job. And he's like. I'm out of the game. He's like, no, you're not. You're never out of the game when you're dealing with me. Like, oh, shit. Some mob shit went down that phone call to get Joe Pesci back in the building, baby. I love this trailer. I love it because it's simple. It's old school. I love old school trailers. Get you in, get you out. I see some de-aging uh, uh, shots on Robert De Niro. That shit look a little, little look like some like a Samsung television screen. Like, that shit look a little, little glossy around his face. I seen that. I seen that. It wasn't it wasn't as raw as you know what I mean like and I seen one shot where they did really good makeup on on Joe Pesci like I'm I'm looking like I'm paying attention to it like this is a very detail oriented 
as far as you know showing them then and now I can see I, I believe it won't be a uh, it'll be a time piece where we'll see this stuff expand out and that's why I look a little like they had a little de-aging factor in the beginning on that phone call um, but I ain't gonna lie this is the type of movie I like to watch you just cuz you watch it you ain't worried about what's going you know you, you pay attention to the story the drive the depth and you enjoy it with mixed in with the acting and these actors been doing this shit since shit before I was born you know they got like 40 50 years on they on they on they record right now and this is what they do this is why they're popular they're famous for doing mob shit you know what I mean so with that being said I'm ready for this motherfucker right here let's watch this teaser trailer one more time that phone even sound legit Hello? Hey, my friend. I got that kid I was talking to you about here. I'm gonna put him on the phone and let you talk to him, okay? Hello? Is that Frank? Yes. Hiya, Frank. This is Jimmy Hoffa. Glad to meet you. Glad to meet you, too, even if it's over the phone. Our friend speaks very highly of you. Thank you. Only three people in the world have one of these. And only one of them is Irish. I heard you paint houses. Yes, I do, sir. Where are you going? I'm going to work. Well, you know, there's a situation going on now, Frank. Big business and the government, they're trying to pull us down. You might be demonstrating the failure to show appreciation. I know things they don't know I know. You can't miss the big picture. Sooner or later. Get the gun out of his hands! Everybody put here as a date when he's gonna go. Do you want to be a part of this fight? Would you like to be a part of this history? Yes, I would. Whatever you need me to do, I'm available. I love it. He likes to talk, don't he? Look at that status. Academy Award winners, yo. God damn! Another hitter. Jeez. You brought the big guns out. All right, um, yeah, I'm feeling this. Um, I uh, I don't know much about Jimmy Hoffa. Uh, I I just, I remember hearing that name and and jokes in my younger time. I don't know much about him, so this will be actually if this is really based on a true event or true story, this is gonna be very informative for me, and hopefully it hits really well because if it does, then I'm gonna look into him. Uh. So I, I don't know I don't know I remember hearing that name Jimmy Hoffa and, and, and I think it was it was, it was some comedians making jokes about him or something I don't know but I remember hearing that name this is obviously based in the 60s so I'm sign me up I like timepiece I love it when we go back to a time where I didn't live so I could see how how realistic it could look and how they could put it together and we already know Martin Scorsese can do that thing but anyway this looks hot I can't wait to watch this it's on Netflix uh, Netflix is doing and in selective theaters Ooh, I need to find out what theater I want to watch this in theaters I want to watch this in theaters most definitely uh, put in the comments down below let me let me know what you guys thought about this are you a mob uh, movie fan or is this doesn't float your boat and if you're not, if you don't like this, tell me why you don't like it. I would love to know why you don't like this. I, I love opinions. I think it's what makes uh, the world go around. And uh, that's all I got, guys. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and push that subscribe button. Thumbs this video up. And don't forget to share Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. I'm J3. And I'm out. Oh.